So what's up guys, how you not doing now? Uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. I hope you guys are very much doing okay. And uh, firstly, uh, before we jump right into anything I want to discuss, try as much as possible to click that like button there and uh, make sure you comment, invite your loved ones, even your enemy as well. You are free to invite them to join the Big Family Adams link. So, of course, you saw the title of this video now. You know, that's why we are catching crews, eh? That's why we are catching crews, you know? Sometimes eh, we still learn some few lessons. And sometimes we still make some kind of like bad judgments because most of you know how much I have supported, I have, uh, sorry, supported Mubaz's father. Most of you know I have supported him well. And sometimes maybe my supporter might be wrong. That was makes us a human being. But right now, I'm kind of like feeling skeptical about it. Too. Like, I know they understand the man again. There was an interview this man did. You know, firstly, he did the one interview a few weeks ago when he said his life is being threatened by Mubaz's wife and uh, the lawyer, Falana, that they are planning to kill him. That's exactly what he, he said. Planning to end his life. Well, that being said, now the one may bust our head now. Eh? Like we say, this man said he's surprised that his own son have a will. He said, I was shocked to discover that my son had a will. Even means father never thought of thought to write a will. That's according to this man's statement. If you a papa may not get one single property to your name, wait till go even come will. Poor man know the right will. Oh. Poor man does he write will. What you want write will for? What you want even write your will for as a poor man? But the the idea, whoever gave him that idea that maybe he could stand up, one makes a statement. Maybe he must have thought about it in his house, or maybe discuss her with people. Nobody from his whole family tell us, hey, Baba, that thing you know, they talk, eh? You know, Bamo, for this guy, this man. Well, let me play the video, guys. Do you believe that I met a lawyer, not a doctor, inside that compound, just for them to arrange what they wanted to arrange? I was so sure when I hear said the 26 years was uh, uh, having a, a will. Me as a father, I'm 50, 60 years of age now. I do not have something like that. I never think of say, writing my will. 26 years old boy was writing a will, which is capital no. So they have to collaborate with the lawyer. The lawyer to, to, to maybe to put his hand into many things that is not right. 26 years of age, now taken off, have his own will. And Mobad is a kind of person that he can never think or say he wants to use and to stop it. So instead of that, he will sign. Because he's dead, they have to call lawyer to do their own mathematics inside. He's so good. He's good and want to expose them. Sir, so, sir, I'm asking. so apparently, maybe the lawyer decide to call him and be like, you know what? What is your grievances? Of course, some of those grievances for this man is that. The wise family are packing everything, and obviously, me, I'd already talked before, say, Mobad father get every right to talk on Mobad's property. Because Mobad, no be old man, may get one big picking, maybe let's say it don't grow. But that's not me, everybody knows. So, Mobad, papa get every right. And, and I say stand on that, that Mobad father get right to speak on Mobad's matter. Based on me, now, father, I'm a man, and I know how it will be, how, it will go, how that matter will pay me to know that. Some person family are trying to pack all my son's wealth. It will pay me too. Let me be honest. We are all human beings, you know. Despite the, the, he's married and everything, it will pay me as well. But the way he's going about it, eh, that is that is the thing that is not really really okay with me because the way he's going about it makes me feel like the man get winch or get hand. He get hand for Mubaz's death. Maybe don't chop the picking. Finish. What did they expect to get from after I chopped the picking? You know, called the get up. Because the whole thing about will, property, and everything is so, so, so obvious. So I believe he meant the lawyer that says, see, oh, the property is made you the, the fight for, see, will for, yeah. Mobile get will. 
<laughs> not the mass shock. <laughs> but obviously, if there should be any form of will, I don't think it's only stamp now, because they use your fingerprint just to the stamp first. I don't think so. I think there should be signature. There should be signature and also stamp. So if there is anything like signature, then you think you find the signature to know the signature is real and also the fingerprint as well. So if it they tell say, okay, now when more bad, if they tell say there, there's kind of like a foul play, then now when it takes say the foul play to take place, is it before Mobad died or after Mobad died or before they buried Mobad or after they buried Mobad because he was the one holding Mobad's body. And after they even uh, uh, dug, dug out uh, Mobad's body, he was the one that they called, okay, that if you want to equally bury Mobad or not. So, where, within those incidents, how, how did the whole thing happen? Where did uh, the Ojo come for enter the whole situation? Well, me, I, I told this man there, uh, Guess yes, honestly, for you to come out, he shouldn't have even make that statement as how come a 26 years old man having a will? Uh -uh. A man that has so much money, a man that uh, uh, is, uh, is a musician, a man that has an account. Of course, obviously, they will ask you who, who is your next of kin. Who is your next of kin? That man we definitely had put Mobada must have definitely written someone's name there as next of kin in his property as well. And some other stuff as well. How about now? That man they call they ask why 26 years old boy may just start to make millions. Why that picking will get will? No, 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 no. In some places, eh, they don't accuse this man of killing his own son. Because this, this, that kind of talk, no follow at all. You no don't follow at all. I think they should ask him. It's just that it cannot be proven in court that he has anything to do with it. You know, I think if they have to go deep into spirituality to check if that man will get hand for Mubaz's death. I supported this man. Oh, I don't tell you, I don't support this man several, 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 several times. But coming out to me, so statement about a child having a will. Ah. If you be 56 years old, you don't get will. Which property you get to show? Eh? You don't have nothing to your name now. That's why, obviously, you don't even think about will. If you say, I beg you, the waiting my picking one share, waiting my children one share for me to the right will. Now, only big man, they think about will. Now let man make get money. Now they think about way. Honestly, honestly, this man and he, this man needs to be checked. He needs to be checked. This man won't inherit a grandson money. On the, see, I believe that if they allow this man, see grandson, uh, if he chop him, <laughs> if he chop the grandson in order to inherit property, I've never seen. I've never seen like it's a taboo for a father to inherit his child's, uh, his child's uh, property or anything that even belongs to the child. It's a taboo. And this man inherited Mubar's clothes. There were claims that after Mubar died, this man was wearing Mubar's clothes. The, the, the obvious thing was that, oh, okay, maybe Mubar died dash and the clothes before he died. This guy was wearing Mobad's clothes. And he said he wanted to continue Mobad's legacy by singing. He dropped few uh, music, then he went on to release album. <laughs> As I then said, they even kind of like uh, trace it to uh, Naramali. Maybe it's Naramali that is helping him with the album. For me, I think Naramali has nothing to do with it. All. Now everything is now becoming obvious. It's not becoming obvious. You see, Mubai died out of uh, family uh, pressure. Family pressure. Now, that's the reason why Mubai died. Nothing else. It's family. Now, family. Now, family. My Mubai. Directly or indirectly. Now, family. 
family made them no they, they they just want to eat this is a man this is a son eh you know for cover well well in a way that over the years you have enjoy well because this guy is talented will drop music upon music upon music over the years you know just chop him you know don't decide to just chop the boy you know just chop him chop him just like that it's crazy no now nah, mobile die oh now nah, he lose nothing else guys i feel bad for him me for the fact that he's not he's not resting at the other time okay you just hear this crazy uh, statement from uh uh adito adito said that she spoke to mobad immediately mobad died she said she saw mobad and Bobad revealed some secrets to her, how he died and everything. Then the question was, if Mobad re uh, revealed some secret to you, how he died, tell us how Mobad died. And they don't say the time for her to tell us how Mobad died don't pass. <laughs> say, you know, if he tell us again. It's crazy, man. Well, let's listen to the, to uh, data. When Mobad started to come to me, the only thing that weakened me about Mobad was when he said, "Say, you know you are too great, you can help me. So it was when he said that, that but you know you are a two person, mm. I was weak. He specifically told me what he wanted. He said, I lost track in life. Okay. I was chasing what I never needed mm -hmm. because I thought I needed to get to where I'm not supposed to get to. This is my path. This is where I went to. But the problem is, now, I can't go to heaven. And I can't rest. I am just like a whirlwind everywhere. I just want to rest where there is solace. That was all he first said to me. His spirit identified that you had these powers and the spirit thought that you could be able to bring him back from the dead. But I wouldn't do that. But you couldn't. So the whole process of that whole thing achieved nothing then? The whole process of that thing achieved a lot. Okay, what was the thing that it achieved? But they didn't allow me to talk and I kept quiet. Who I didn't wanted allow you to. Talk? You see the way the social media people started yes. to do this, do this. Can you tell at least share with me? Today. I'm not social media people. Today. Whether you're social media people or not, mm -hmm. Mubad is dead. Yes. Mubad said a lot. Right. The time when I wanted to talk, right. I didn't. That didn't mean that I didn't do a lot behind as a person. So, so the thing that what you know, Mobad wanted mm -hmm. is more of a spiritual thing and told me a lot of things that led to his death, how everything transpired and all of that, right. which I took my time mm -hmm. and I listened. I went to five different mountains. Mm -hmm. And you know the funny thing? I even posted it on my status. When we were leaving F1 Lai, he came clear mm -hmm. on the sky. I wasn't only the one who saw it, even the other pastors saw it. So what he wanted mm -hmm. was more, because he mm -hmm. said this whole thing is going to cause chaos, drama, unable to unravel, but this mm -hmm. is this, this is this, this is this. And I understand very well. Right, right. So you're saying that whatever it is he wanted to accomplish... If I had spoken, he yeah. would have settled Mubad's issue since. But because people thought she's a cloud chaser, yeah. it's not possible so to speak it, to so the... It, I just kept watching. See, listen. So you don't care what people... I don't care what people yes, so say. So why would you stop the assignment listen, for them? I don't care what people say, but mm. I have achieved the most important thing. Okay. So nobody's going to come back and tell you that Mubad is appearing today. Okay, I right. had over right. 100 people who say, ah, and see, I saw Mubad. Some people mm. not believe. In fact, there is a lady who Mubad went, a pregnant woman, who she pleaded to go back into her womb. Mm. And you know, when this lady chatted me, I saw her. I asked her. I said, who gave you this name? She chatted with her Instagram page. I chatted, I said, who are you? She was coding. I said, don't code. I know you very well. I said, where is your grandmother? Your grandmother initiated. You gave this speech. She said, auntie, how did you know? I said, you're asking me how I got to know. You're talking to a prophetess. And you're asking me a prophetess how I got to know. You know, the most important thing is that boy, this is a worldly fight. Mm -hmm. But that boy wanted a spiritual settlement. Right. So he, he wanted to his. rest. Right. Did you ever hear anybody telling you Mubad is coming to them? He's resting. Right. Madam, tell us what you are put to bad. You are beating around the bush. You talk here, you talk there, you talk here. Since you say you can see the spirituality, why not just do just do the needful? Don't allow us to go through this whole incident again. Just tell us, okay, this is what Mobad said. And we we might believe you. Because many people do not understand why you will say you spoke to Mobad and Mobad told you how he died. And you don't want to tell us how Mubad died. 
It's stressful. Talking from left to right without saying a thing. Well, I don't understand the spirituality behind the whole process. How she used to see things. Me, myself, I don't even want to understand it. I don't ever want to see spirit. I don't ever want to come across any form of spirit or even mobile spirit. So, Adeto, please eh, tell us how he died. Tell us what Mobai told you how he died. So that we will settle this matter. Sorry. If they were calling you Clan Chesa, I'm sorry. We are sorry. Now tell us how the matter happened.